Hi, it's Pastor Harley Wheeler with the Broadway United Methodist Church. I want to share with you out of the book of Ruth, a wonderful story to read. Maybe you should just pick it up and read it today. It doesn't take very long. And uh, the verses I'm looking at are verses 16 and 17 in the first chapter. But Ruth said, Entreat me not to leave thee, or to return from following after thee. For whither thou goest, I will go, and whither thou lodgest, I will lodge. Thy people shall be my people, and thy God my God. Where thou diest, I shall die, and there will I be buried. May the Lord do so to me, and more also, if aught but death parts thee from me. I memorized that. I've just not to brag, but I've just known that for for nearly all my life out of uh, the King James Version. Haven't heard it read at weddings even though it was spoken by a daughter-in-law to a mother-in-law, and really, in ancient times, it wasn't the mother-in-laws who were thought to be trouble, but daughter-in-laws were proverbial for, for causing a bit of disturbance in the family structure. But Ruth is a daughter-in-law who professes steadfast, continuing, faithful love to her mother-in-law. They're both down on their luck. They've lost their husbands. Uh, they have fled a famine. They, they're in poverty. Uh, Ruth has been told perhaps she should go back to her father's family in Moab, and she's, no, I'm sticking with you. Love that will not let go. Love that is steadfast, and it is a mirror for God's love. Uh, we don't offer a lot for God. You know, I, you know some of people have been called a brand plucked from the burning. What use is a charred piece of wood? Uh, even one that the fire has been put out, then it's soggy. We don't have a lot to offer God. God offers us his steadfast love. He will not give up on us. Ruth is a story about steadfast love changing the course or, or contributing to the work of God to redeem his people and changing the course, really, of history. It occurs in a sad time, the judges, where things were beginning to fall apart, but it points to the coming of the Messiah. It points to David the king, and it points to what difference it can make to show steadfast love in our lives. Go forth, do that. Be blessed.